low that was in 1946. 67 for your high in Clintonville today, also 67 in Port Edwards in the southern part of the area, off and on showers and some sprinkles and light showers in the Northwoods as well. 64 in Minocqua, 65 in Antigo. It'll probably be a little bit lighter in the north than farther south in the area. It's kind of what we see here on our future track, uh, more persistent rain in the south and southwestern parts of the area, but overall it will be damp for your Friday and damp tonight as well. Here you see midnight and into the early morning hours on Saturday. It's going to be kind of gloomy out there, but don't be dismayed. The, the, all the weekend is not going to be gloomy. No, uh, here you see midday on Saturday, still maybe a little bit cloudy, but a northwest breeze is going to pick up in the afternoon, bring in a little bit drier air. So the sun should break out. And then as we go into Sunday here, daybreak should be dry uh, and only a slight chance a shower might pop up on Sunday. Otherwise, looking pretty good. Same thing on Monday. So some nice weather to enjoy after today. 66 and kind of gloomy for today. Good day for doing indoor things. Maybe getting a little shopping done or something like that. And then 57 overnight. Still some sprinkles and drizzle. And it'll be gloomy tomorrow morning. But we will see a bit of sun later as that northwest wind develops. 71 for the high. So later in the afternoon, plans for getting outside on Saturday. Looking good and looking good on Sunday. Monday too. Only a slight chance of an isolated shower or storm on Sunday. And Monday should be dry. It's Monday night that we'll have another chance of some rain or a couple of thunder showers going into Tuesday. And it looks pretty seasonal for the middle of next week as well. But it is getting close to fall. The Orioles are migrating. That's what Judy says. She sent in this pretty picture from Stetsonville.